we're trying to uh, just tidy it up a bit. Um, shouldn't be too much trouble, but I had, we had these cans here, so we're using them. We've got a gallon, oh yeah, four litres gallon, and we'll paint it properly. Uh, uh, as usual, I forgot. I had to. I was so had so many hassles. The spray gun was uh, running at the air, it's not running in proper into the spray gun because it's air operated one. And so I uh, it was very frustrating. And I forgot I had to, when I was painting my bobcat that I had to uh, video it, didn't I? <laughs> so yeah. So I'll uh, take you up and have, get you to have a look. Take you up and have, take you around it. Show you what I've done. Um, sometimes you forget, you know. Oh, that that would have been worth filming, you know. And, anyway. uh, because it's got a lot of glass and it's hard to spray, I'll be doing it in stages. But I painted the uh, the top on it. It was all rusty before. I don't go, to, I'm not going to the trouble of um, masking up all the glass. I just clean it down afterwards. Anyway, and also that, that's the back where the um, motor is. And that's the, uh, to protect all the dust going into the motor. I'll take you back and show you uh, what we're doing down here. I'm just going to prepare it a bit. Look, it is an old machine. So I'm just going to prepare it a bit, knock off the stickers and uh, paint the little fella. I'm just using a buffing pad, a bit coarse, but it is an animal. Like I was saying to you before, I um, what we used to have, we used to have, we used to have fuel stations as a kid. Well, I didn't. My parents had one, and I was a kid. And uh, so, and we had panel shops and mechanical shops and that. I learned to be a mechanic. Uh, but the side of um, the the likes of doing this is just something I we picked up at the time. I used to work with all the panel builders I used to have mates with. And uh, I can get fussy, but I usually, like this, it's not worth the effort. I just make it as neat as possible because at the end of the day, uh, I'm not panel beating it. Um, because it'll, uh, I just straighten out a few holes and dents. I didn't have the gear with me. I've sat in my other house, at my house, so um, I, I don't know why it's not here. Anyway, just giving you a bit of a rundown.
You liking that so far? I hope so. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do. My battery went flat, so my son had to put his phone on. I tend to use phones because uh, my camera was a real good one, but it doesn't like um, videoing, does it? So, and I'm not, I don't feel like throwing it away, but I might have to get a better one. Oh, it's a good camera, it's just that, that model of Sony. <laughs> Coming inside inside for a internal paint. Uh, yesterday I put a black on it, um, so I had some black paint, but this is actually a grey, a dark grey, so it doesn't make it go any faster, but it looks like it is. <laughs> the excavator is done pretty well, just got to put the lid back on it and mold it up. Uh, bit of detailing just to cover up a few things there that need to be hand painted. Um, too, otherwise too messy and then I'll be we'll do the bobcat finish the bobcat off so yeah so uh if you like what you've seen give it a big thumbs up so ring that notification bell and uh subscribe if you haven't subscribed before uh, that way you get to see all the latest stuff come, that come through just getting all the uh, a bit of turps on my hand, then it's trying to get all the paint off myself. Anyway, the only thing I've got to do next on this thing, uh, the bucket on that has got a, a, a bolted on bucket, a bolted on edge. Uh, I don't like that. I'm going to take it off. Over here, it's been damaged all along the bottom, it's all peeled up and everything. I've got to lift it up, straighten it out. That's why I didn't paint down there. Don't need to anyway, it rubs off. Uh, oh yeah, I didn't turn around, sorry. Along the bottom edge, you can see it's curled up there on the edge. And over there, it's curled up. Bit of a dint there, it's a little bit buckled. So I've just got to get in there and straighten it out. That'll be one of my next projects. <laughs> 